Hello everyone, it is time for our nightly reading. I'm sorry I didn't do one last night, but that's why I skipped and did whatever the other day. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Actually, I think I put the bonuses on Sunday just so I could take a day off yesterday. So I'm sorry I wasn't around, y'all. I needed days, right? We got the Emperor! Crushing the Devil! Be having his supremacy. That's who we're reading for today. Remember, guys, if this resonates with you, good deal is not to not worry about it because this is an all signs reading. It probably won't resonate with all of you, which is fine. No worry about it. No biggie, right? And remember, they won't work if you don't believe in it, or maybe they will. Damn you. Phone with your shit. Okay, anyway. Also, if any of you want a personal reading, my email, Instagram, and Facebook are down below. I would personally prefer my email, but whichever one works for you, I really don't care. <laughs> All readings, the first one's free of charge. Everything else comes with a price, of course, and I do take tips and donations. Thank you very kindly in advance. So anyway, first card, six of pentacles. Someone's being cheapskate and they need to make a decision, right? We also have the thoughts and feelings the devil reverse. Wasn't that person trying to crush the devil before? Yeah, but now the devil's kind of sneaking. And the root of that is they feel empty. Oh my god. Please don't be a weirdo. <laughs> we get enough of those in the readings already, don't we? Yes, we do. I wish I could move this over slightly more. Well, that kind of helped a little, because you really can't see the edge of it. Well, I think you can, but I'm not sure. Hangman. And the King of Swords. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Also up here. Huh. What's the vibration for this person, please? This beautiful spirit. They are leaving the fire. They possibly could have started, but you never know. But something's on fire and they're moving to somewhere else. They don't know what's on the other side of that land, but they can make something out of it. Six of Swords. Moving to calmer waters. Yes! Fuck you, phone. That is the only thing I don't like about, like, my phone right now. The notifications are just... Well, I can probably change... The, yeah, let's turn... Yeah, there we go. That works. Yes. There we go. We'll just leave it at that. Maybe that'll help with the notifications, because that bitch is loud. I didn't even think about that. Anyway, so this person needs to make a choice about something, right? And that something has to do with, like, either being a beggar or being a giver. I don't know which one it is, but the giver is kind of like, you know, half-ass... Like, not even half-assing, like, five-sixth half-assing. Or, wait, five-sixth assing? Or, I don't know. Either way, like, this person doesn't give too much, I don't feel like, at least to people who ask. Or it could be somebody who is uh, not getting enough from the people above them, and that's why they're making a choice. Now, they might feel like they want to sneak away with the devil to calmer waters because they just don't feel like they're being fulfilled in the situation they're in. They want to say some shit, but they're waiting for the right time. And then they will spring their truth. Like the uh, king of swords right here. Like, I got this that almost fell out, and it's like this person's planning their escape while their captors are talking about football season. The Dodgers! No, the Rams! No, the Do Is the Dodgers baseball or football? I never- I don't know. I don't- I really don't know. Like, I'm not that smart. <laughs> what I know. Um, let's see. So. Yeah, there's nothing starting to give whatever. Hmm. Alright, so this is the person who is giving, but not giving very much, right? 
or no, 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 no. This is a um. This is the person who's trying to get something and they're not. They're trying to get enough to like start something with their home. And it's like they kept telling themselves, you know, like everything will get better. Trying to make that candle brighter than the sun, right? Trying to make this reality, reality, period, right? And re remember, reality is all about perception. That's why it's very important not to let people know exactly what you believe. Because once people can hinder that perception, they can make you believe whatever you want to be believe, you know? Like, your belief is your willpower. Your free will. Don't let people screw it up. And it's like this person, like, you know, they sit in their home, then it's like the person who actually has the money sits in their house comfortably while the other person, you know, is just out in the cold suffering, but they don't seem to care that much because they're only given so much, you know? They're given the bare minimum, and that's not enough to start something, start a home, start whatever. They're just convincing themselves, you know, oh, it'll work, but they're still not doing enough. So a decision needs to be made. Mind you, two of swords, right? Listen to this. And I, this is for anyone who's new, right? Both of these people will die regardless of which head will be cut off, right? Just one will have a more painful death than the other. Because these are Siamese twins. Now, the reason why they both die. Sure, you'll be able to choose one and give them a quicker death. But the problem is, is blood poisoning. The dead body won't have enough oxygen in it to circulate and keep all the blood cells alive. In order to keep the other half alive as well so they'll probably die a more suffering death it's all about the choices of which way do you want to go before everything just is you know horribly demised and destroyed and ruined and all that like both of these dudes are gonna go but one's gonna go before the other one so they need to figure it out right uh, might be a king of pentacles here talking shit to his buffalo friend letting things die off um, and this is like more than they're they're biting off more than they can chew really Because this tower Everybody knows it, but they're just ignoring it Like they don't even care if the lightning struck it Hmm Strange it's like a um, Yeah, decision needs to be made. It could be a Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. And it's like this person talks so much shit that they don't think about the fact that, you know, uh, what they're doing is just ruining their own chances of whatever. And that's why nobody's really paying attention when this bad shit happens to them with the tower. Like, it's already exposed, it's already known, everyone's just pretending it isn't happening just yet, right? Now, this Devil Reverse could be easily Capricorn, so it could be Capricorn over here talking shit, or someone's doing that to Capricorn, thinking that they're tough shit and they're not the buffalo, which, you know, can easily happen, right? This Capricorn is fleeing because, or this Devil's sneaking away because there was a love relationship a long, long time ago, right? That they weren't able to fight and maim and argue and tussle around like there was a relationship that they I think they fought extremely hard for you know but it all ended in unfairness and heartbreak and they're still kind of mourning that too they might have dealt with a cancer who's just insane but you know that that happens that's that that's literally every fucking cancer you meet <laughs> such as their name is Ech. <laughs> And they don't feel like waiting to see how things turn out. It, it'd be a fruitful end, but they're just like, you know what? Fuck this. I'm ending this. You know? They're feeling a little bit unfulfilled emotionally down here. Nothing's working for them with the Seven of Cups. That's the root of their problems. Um, they don't feel like moving to anything that's going to be dangerous, though. Like, they don't want to take kind of risks like that. Um, but they are willing to go in the dark to be a victor over people who aren't even going to fight them. That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> it's like they're look, waiting for a battle that's not coming, so they're automatically a victor. And that's the wrong idea. What's with this, um, Six of Swords with the vibration? Moving on to calmer waters, because things probably aren't working out somewhere, other with a job or with co-workers, stuff like that. And they feel like they're doing all the work on their own. With the Eight of Pentacles. 
That's why they're leaving. I assume we're moving to calmer waters. This is like, well, I'm gonna do this all by myself. I might as well start my own business, or I might as well do this, or go somewhere where people will actually help me, you know? Like one of those things, right? We got the Knight of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. This person wants to run in and argue with the person who's giving and not giving enough. He wants to act like they care. That, lo that Those cups are not worth turning around for. It makes them feel trapped. Like, they're trapped by their emotions and how much they love this shit. Like, yeah, their cups are spilled, but there are those other cups there. But they feel like the romance, like the two of cups, right? They feel like it's not enough because it keeps them trapped and stuff. So they just decide, you know, like, I want to run in and say some shit. But you're not worth communicating to, you know, like, you don't give me enough, but you're going to pretend that you're worried about me? No, you're not. Like, you know, the hanged man. Time has come to yield. Time has come to surrender or something. Perfect timing considering all of the planetary movements and shit, right? Um, wanting happiness for Rizzle, my nizzle. Um, ready to sacrifice. A, uh, they're ready to sacrifice one cup for some other cups. Just be like, here, bitch. Take your cup back. I'm just going to make two of my own. They at least have water. This does not. This belongs to you. This, take this back to your house. Plaster it up or whatever it is you need to do. Because uh, I'm not falling for your temptation, Satan. <laughs> just be like, nah, it's cool, man. It's, it's cool. I, I ain't even doing this right here. <laughs> So that's why they're squashing the devil, but it's not really the devil. It's more like the person they think is the devil is getting away with shit. And they're just like, get behind me, Satan, you bitch, you know? This king of swords right here, coming up with honesty, expressing himself very clearly, letting them know about all this shit on yonder, you know? <clears throat> Wants to take a leap of faith, maybe a clean slate somewhere, start something anew. But it feels like they're wasting time. Like, I think they want to start it. I think this querent wants to start over in this scenario, relationship, job, whatever it is. But it's like, I'm, I'm kind of wasting my time. You know? Uh, I feel kind of like a, an abandoned. I, I feel like you left me on my fifth birthday, Dad. I'm just saying, like, you know, or my eighth birthday, since there's eight here, it's like, you know, they felt abandoned, but now those emotions are leaving. It's just like, this is a waste of my time. Like, I want a new beginning because I'm tired of feeling like I don't want to be here anymore. They've been wishing on that with, and that shooting star to get away from these emotions, which is a perfect time right now because this is a really good time to be releasing shit that no longer serves you. You're mad at someone? Let that shit go. You want to hear something? Or deal with someone's bullshit, just let it go. Just, just let them say whatever they want to say, smile, and just go back to do whatever the hell you were doing, you know? They're man this querent is manifesting because they've been insecure for a while and they want to finally let their guard down, but they still got this bitch over here, like, hey, I'm still if I had something you. I came with the suckers. <laughs> they, like, they, like, they definitely got, like, some regrets in this situation for real but it's like you know i gotta I, I gotta get some shit done i can't keep mulling over these fucking cups all the time like i got pentacles to carve you know now there was a third party situation that led to a breakup so now they're just gonna be like well i'm gonna go somewhere else i'm gonna give my cup to someone else then which queen of cups could also be cancer because of the chariot right it's always Fucking cancers, I swear. Nothing against you, cancers. Just saying. Y'all would be the ones to boil somebody's rabbit. But then you'd feel bad for burning the rabbit because rabbits are sweet, cuddly creatures. But not enough to where you wouldn't think anything about it because it's just like, well, it was their bunny, so fuck them. You know? If this person who's watching this night walk away... Either 
this person's pissed because this person's walking away or they're trying to approach this person as the Knight of Cups, but their vitriol and hostility and animosity comes out all on it. Like the Wheel of Fortune's here too, you know? Like, hmm. And it's like, after all this time, they held a grudge, but now it's like they want to come back in from the cold and be like, hey, I see you working. Can I come over? No. Go fuck off. <laughs> I'm busy. Do you not see that? Like, this bird's trying to run for victory because they've been a bitter bitch, the Empress, for a minute, right? They want to fight for what it is. They want to get over all their obstacles. They want to manage to get the right thing done. They want to tip the scales to where, like, all's cool, right? They still feel like they want to go for that booty, though. And then they're like, nah, nah, I, I ain't saying shit. I ain't saying shit. Because they already know the person would just be really immature and then, like, be really judgy. And then this person would just have to sit there staying in their power just be like, how many ways do you want me to make you cry? Because I know at least 60, you know, air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Like this person voices that, uh, this querying voices that like everything looks like shit. It's been shit. And they'd rather just be alone and produce their own pentacles instead of stick around this situation. And that is the right judgment call. Yay. So. That's the reading, everybody. If you enjoyed this, like, share, subscribe if that's what you want to do. Certainly make me happy, but I will not force you. I promise. From the bottom of my little black heart. But I will see you guys later. I love yous. You guys take it easy. Bye-bye.